The incredible biodiversity found in Costa Rica is supported by life-giving water. The streams, rivers, waterfalls, and even the clouds are the foundation of Costa Rica's dense rainforests and high-altitude cloud forests. These, in turn, are home to countless species of plants, birds, insects, mammals, amphibians, and reptiles. Mist-shrouded mountains, jungle rivers, and mighty rainforests are filled with dynamic, colorful, and approachable photo subjects. The varied locations and subjects offer photographers limitless chances to use telephoto lenses, wide-angle views, and lots of opportunities for macro photography. We travel from site to site in our comfortable private bus that has plenty of room for us and our photo gear. Arenal Volcano and Selva Verde are rainforest habitats with beautiful trails for easy wildlife photography access. The Rio Frio in Caño Negro is a great place for photographing from a boat, even with long lenses and tripods. The stability of the boat and the expertise of our guides make this a consistently successful destination to photograph kingfishers, caiman, and basilisk lizards. The cloud forests of the Talamanca Mountains are home to bromeliads, lichen-covered trees, and is the habitat of the endangered resplendent quetzal. These mountains are also the habitat for numerous species of hummingbirds, like the violet saber wing. No matter where we go, our expert photo savvy guides put us in great position to make stunning photographs of Costa Rica's natural beauty. A lot of birds out there. The variety of birds in Costa Rica is astounding. Each destination and habitat has a new cast of characters for us to see and photograph. Here are but a few. Costa Rica's mammals live in a variety of habitats. Peccaries and white-nosed coati search for food on the rainforest floor. Here, a three-fingered sloth browses in slow motion through the cecropia trees. They move so slowly that algae grows on their fur, giving it a green cast. Even with the slow pace of a sloth's movement, it's a challenge to capture the exact moment for a dramatic portrait. One of my favorite animals in Costa Rica is the amazing tamandua, a small anteater who hunts in the treetops for insects to eat. White-faced capuchin, spider, and howlers are among the several species of monkeys that live in Costa Rica. Reptiles are common and approachable. Spectacled caiman, green iguana, and the spectacular basilisk join snakes such as the eyelash pit viper and the boa constrictor as dramatic photo subjects. This five foot long arboreal vine snake with its wide set jaws designed to ambush hummingbirds posed for a macro photo shoot. A trip to Costa Rica wouldn't be complete without photographing tree frogs and poison dart frogs. Searching the litter on the forest floor or turning over leaves can reap rewards when looking for these jewel-like amphibians. As beautiful as these tiny frogs are, finding them in interesting and beautiful settings is the challenge. Butterflies, moths, caterpillars, praying mantis, and leafcutter ants are among the thousands of insect species to find and photograph in the rainforest. 
The sheer number of species and subjects will lead to a large and varied macro portfolio. Being in the rainforest, it's most appropriate that we stay in a lodge built in the rainforest canopy. Selva Verde Lodge is located in the Sarapaki district. The facilities allow guests to enjoy a relaxing stay in the heart of a virgin rainforest on the banks of the Sarapaki River and offer the opportunity for non-stop photography on the grounds. Costa Rica is high on my list of nature photo destinations because of its biodiversity, ease of travel, great places to stay, and the accessibility of the wildlife. The photos speak for themselves. When in Costa Rica, there's an odd combination of secluded tranquility coupled with the excitement of a photographic hunt. I hope you have the opportunity to experience that feeling.